when Texas resident Norma McCorvey became pregnant for the third time, she wanted an abortion. At 21, she was already a mother of two, divorced, and nursing multiple addictions. She wasn't in hash x27, t able to get one, what she got instead was a crusade pegged to her name, or rather, her pseudonym. Designated Jane Roe, McCorvey and hash x27, S case would culminate in the landmark 1973 Supreme Court ruling Roe v. Wade, which enshrined abortion as a constitutional right in the United States. In the several years the case took to reach its outcome, she did not attend a single trial. McCorvey was hardly an ideal representative of the pro-choice movement. When she began to speak out publicly, she revealed herself to be an unreliable narrator of her own story and, eventually, something of a liability to the cause. An encounter with a born-again Christian minister in the mid-90s led to her changing allegiance in the abortion debate, becoming the most ironical of pro-life converts. McCorvey and Hash X27, S180 was spurred in part by a feeling that both her needs and her voice had been sidelined by the lawyers nominally representing her. She thought that the movement and Hash X27, S leaders really wanted in quat, a demure, white glove lady in quat, a bill she didn't in Hash X27, T fit. Perhaps they would in hash x27. They preferred to have as their poster woman someone like Joy Griffin, the chipper upper middle class housewife at the center of abortion drama Call Jane, played by Elizabeth Banks, Charlie and hash x27, s angels. Although informed by her doctor that her pregnancy poses a risk to her life, as a resident of Chicago in 1968, she and hash x27, s unable to access even a in quat, therapeutic termination in quat, and quat, just fall down a staircase, and quat, advises the secretary at a psychiatrist and hash x27 s office almost offhandedly between answering phone calls and quat it worked for me and quat joy is shocked she tentatively investigates alternative options the phone number on a solicitous seeming flyer and quat pregnant anxious get help call jane and quat see 